Welcome to King Joe's comic book collections. King okay, on over. Today's an unboxing. Why'd you bring Italian bread down here? Because I'm hungry. Well, I'll make you a sandwich after we do this. A uh, little one wants to tell you, gal, all you people out there on YouTube who have been wishing her well comments. What are you going to say? Uh, thank you for uh, saying that I hope I feel better. Thank you. Uh, now I'm going to open this package up. This, I think, is actually the uh, trade I'm doing with a guy on Facebook. Let's see. Yep. Wow. These got here fast. Spider-Man Red Sonja, number one. Spider-Man Red Sonja, number two. Spider-Man Red Sonja, number three. Number four and number five, and then I got the New Avengers and the Transformers. Number one, number two, number three, and number four. Now tomorrow I have to go and I have to mail him some Star Wars cards out. And this is the package. I when he told me he was going to mail me a package, I was like, yeah. Min, Brian, Min's, M, Miski, like, I can't pronounce that, I can't pronounce that thing, I, I'll, I'll probably murder it, but, Brian says he's going to send me a package, here it is, it came in the mail today, uh, my trusty bat knife, super taped, now let's see how this thing works. Hollow fall. What the hell is what are you playing? Nope. Tell you, you did a real good job packing it. Ah oh, yes. Oh no. Every time I think I'm done needing it, I gotta get it back. Oh! What? <laughs> okay. I'm going to read whatever here is. Hey, Joe. Well, I'm still trying to catch up on sending out everyone's prizes for joining the football league, so here are here are yours. First is the Rocket Raccoon free comic book day issue you missed. The other stuff I hope you don't already have. <laughs> I love it. Well, it's awful hard. Uh, I watched one, one of your videos, and you showed the... Richie Ashburn beer can, but I didn't see the other two that I had, so hope you enjoyed them. You are definitely in the in the league. Yeah! So still, yeah, I gotta start studying, because I have no clue who's or what. Fantasy Football Draft Guide. Now let's see what we got here. Little padding. Yeah, tabs! He knows I love tabs. I always say if people are going to ship stuff, they should put tabs on because it makes it easier for unboxing. Look at that. He has pulled them away. Today I actually went to a chiropractor. I actually feel pretty good. Never went to one before. And dun dun dun! Free comic book day, Rocket Raccoon. Thank you, Brian. And let's see what else we got here. I see beer cans. Let's see. Then we'll start with the. I actually don't have uh, a lot of doubles of my beer cans. I don't think I have like one or two RC Cola cans doubles. KC Leg. Oh, who's this guy? Valley Forge Brewing. Whitey Ford. Oh, my dad will like that when I show it to him. My dad's a big Yankees fan. And Duke Schneider. Wow. Thank you, Brian. This, these are nice. I only have the the one the one can and I actually got it at a flea market, so 
Hopefully, me and Brian can get together. We were discussing about, she's saying about his family wants to go to the Corning Museum. If I could talk my wife into taking her, I was actually going to tell tell you, Brian, if you want to meet up, I'll bring my double comic books with me. <laughs> Which is funny, it's about 10 bucks. I'll just load the back of the van up. It'll be like a traveling comic book store. I'll bring my double books. Maybe we can trade in the parking lot and take the wipes off. But tomorrow she goes and gets her cast on. Uh, Not tomorrow. Oh, yeah. What's today? Today's Wednesday. Okay, yeah. Friday she goes and gets her cast on. She don't want to go to school tomorrow. She tried to go to school today, and she said that her arm bothered her too much. So when the wife gets home, I got to see about talking to her about maybe keeping her home for a week. Would you like that? Because you ain't going to go to school on Friday anyway because you have to get your cast put on. But I want to thank you, Brian, again. This is good. This is great. I, uh, if you got Skype, add me on Skype. JPC615. I, yeah, because I only have, I, this is before that people started using my, 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 my number, so. And, um. Uh, I actually got to get, this weekend I got to see about, for Tony White Not Art, I got to get a hold of, uh, I got to actually take pictures of all, I'm going to bring all my comic books in from the garage, it's going to be a nice fun thing this weekend. Like I said, I'm going to do a video of what I have for trade, I'm just going to take stills and I'm going to do show pictures of them. So this way, every maybe two or three months, I'll just redo the trade video and just do the stills and just minus the ones I got rid of. Because it's actually starting to be a pain because I have way too many doubles. Figure I have at least at least ten boxes out there filled with doubles. So even with all my trading, I, it's like I constantly keep getting more because the, I am not up to date on my con. Well, where is it? These. My comic collector's program. I am not up to date. It says I only have 8, 18,700 comics in my comic collector. And I know I have over 21,000 books. So I actually have to get my butt in gear and try to get all my books into the collector. So I do not buy doubles. Like I said already, I almost bought the double first appearance of Harley Quinn, Harley Quinzel, uh, in Batman Adventures number 12 because I forgot I bought it. Because, like, I was going through a lot of the uh, keys. And you guys know I just got the Human Target Season season 1 box set. And just for the hell of it, I wanted to see uh, when the first appearance of Christopher Chance, the Human Target, was. And thank God I have. It is actually Action Comics 419. Uh, the first Human Target actually appeared in a Batman comic. But it wasn't called Christopher Chance. And then he was also in a thing called... Uh, Gangbusters, they're like there's two previous appearances before he had, it was actually Christopher Chance as the human target. So, I uh, I do have the first of true appearance of Christopher Chance as the human target, so I was happy when I got that. But these bad boys are going to go up on my, up on, over my, my cabinet. I got to figure out where I'm going to, because I'm going to put all the Casey Lager beer at least I got my cabinet finished. We're going tonight. Her, her her softball team is playing a game tonight. Last night's game got rained out. And they're playing a game tonight. And good old dad here is, since, is the assistant coach. All because she can't play doesn't mean dad can't go and coach. So I sit there. She roots on her team. She's there for moral support for everybody. Right? Maybe we'll stop for ice cream on the way home. I told Brian, Brian goes, take you for ice cream, Mr. Treat. I'm like, I'll take you for, I was going to take you for ice cream last night on the way home. Okay. Sounds good. Hello, McFly. Sounds good. Okay, well, tell everybody goodbye and thank you again. You're too busy watching Cloudy with a chance of meatballs, too. Steve!
deep, chimpanzees deep, chimpanzees deep, chimpanzees shove. I loved in the first movie when good old Steve, they were like, oh, what, oh Steve's playing, oh, they even have chocolate. That's not chocolate ice cream. You remember that? Okay. Well, I want to thank all you guys. Brian, these are awesome. Beer cans, I love them. I love my, I love, well, I love my collection. Period. But thank you for the Rocket Raccoon. Uh, I wish my comic shop had it. Actually, I was going through. I was amazed at how many different free issues there were compared to what I actually picked up and compared to what out there because I didn't know there was a tick. There was actually a free hardcover book they were giving away too. I found out, and I'm like, wow. Uh, I'm actually hoping that this summer works out good. I would love to meet. Uh, you guys go to the Pittsburgh Comic Con, you and Pittsburgh Zombie. I think it would be cool all of us to hang out. Uh, I know Anthony's going to the Philly Comic Con, and I made a comment about that's the end of June, but now with everything with her and my neighbor, I don't know if he's going to be around to do this, so I'm going to actually have to pay. And plus, I blew my tractor out again. It seems like every year, but that was because of my neighbor, what will happen with my tractor, because... He blocked up the way, and then when I went around, he had stuff laying in the grass, and it was on my property, and I ran over it because I couldn't see it. So something happened to my tractor again. So that's more money i got to tie up. I always have a going on in the beginning of the year with my tractors and my mowers because of not cutting it. I need a sickle. But let's go. I'll make you upstairs. I'll make you a sandwich. What do you want to eat? You want hot dogs? What do you want to eat? PB and J. PB, oh yeah, peanut butter and jelly sandwich. Okay, well, King Joe out. Lexi can say out if you want. Yeah, she's really into it, watching the thing. Okay, goodbye everybody.